What's so funny, TSM? <laughs> You're beautiful, you gotta wake up And beauty do apply to if you wanna wear the makeup Be proud of what you is, put your lipstick on Go up in your glam bag, fix your face if you want it You don't succeed, try again, apply it to the skin If you know what I know, then you would dive right into the glamour of the makeup So what it's gonna take us, for you to gonna wake up And that's to fix your face up <laughs> I'm back! Welcome back to my channel. The struggle is real with the makeup nurse. Today is Two Tart Tuesday and it's Chucky the Victorious Killer Doll Day and Greasy Food Day and Sourest Day. Alright, let's get started. We are going to start with the Awake Serum from Tarte. are going to use the Don't Hate Hydrate Moisturizer from well, Sugar Rush but Tarte owns it. Still don't know what that smell is. It's kind of like a sweet smell but can't pinpoint what type of sweet. Okay, I gave my other lip um, my uh, glaze, tart lip glaze to my sister, so I'm going to use the Awake um, Lip Therapy Mask today from Tarte. Just to moisten our lips. Alright, we're going to use the Too Faced Eyeshadow Insurance the eye primer today. And I have a board meeting today, so hopefully everything goes well. Not that I need to do anything. I just pretty much sit back and listen. And if they ask a question, then I answer it. My boss does most of the talking in that meeting. I guess I'm just there to look pretty. So I better get this face on, huh? All right. We're going to use the Too Faced Naturalized Palette. I don't smell anything today with this one. Darn it. I thought I would actually smell this. Okay. We are going in with Strip Poker. Okay, now we are going with, let's go with Cashmere Bunny.
Because these are more light, I'm going to go in with the cocoa cream from Too Faced to kind of outline this. And I know that's what, not why um, liquid eyeshadow is supposed to be for is a cut crease, but you know. I found another use for it since I don't really go towards these eyeshadows and I got a bunch of them so all right we're gonna go in with um, let's go in with push-up Alright, what my brush, let's define it a little bit more. I actually did pretty good without it. But I just like to make sure it's like even. Because my fingers, it's hard to get exactly on the lines that I want. Alright, let's go in with Honey Pot now. Some of these are really new shades that I haven't dipped in to this palette, but I think I've only used this palette twice. And I think I used the same shades. Because some of these shades, like the Honey Pot and the Push Up, don't look touched. And the Cashmere Bunny, that one didn't look touched either. Alright, we're going to use the Tarte Eyeliner, Tartist Eyeliner. Now the wing. Oops. This is not even, guys. Well. All right. I totally messed up on my eyeliner. Oh well. Let's do it underneath. Maybe I can fix it when I get my foundation on and stuff. I just used the other end of this. Okay, I'm going to use the Tarte Quench. The Tarte C Quench primer. I do kind of smell like a refreshing smell. Oh, I, uh -oh. I can't be. I'm like, I know there's more in there. This little thing has lasted me a long time, though. Okay, now I have the Tarte Seek Lotion. It's 
So how was your weekend? Mine, I didn't do anything but do some filming and relax. I'm going to be starting um, some training for a different, uh, I get to do another class for Medline, which Medline is a big huge company that does medical supplies and I get to do some um, performance improvement training with them, so I'm really excited, but that I don't know when that will be. All right, now we're going to go in with the foundation, and we're going to go in with the Tarte Amazonian Clay Foundation. Looks like I hope there's going to be enough. There should be. All right. All right. Even though I always use a lot of foundation, that actually today I haven't used uh, as much as I normally do, but this stuff does go a long way in its coverage. It's got a good coverage. And it's got a good wear test, too. Okay, I have the Ultra Creamy Concealer. Use this so many Tuesdays too, and it's so tiny. I can't believe how much. And I use a lot. <clears throat> so I've actually been impressed at how long I've had the look. That one and the other one. Nice. The other one I still have quite a bit left. So just think how long a full size and not like a little sample would do, take you. Now granted, I only really use them on Tuesdays, so that's only once a week, but still. All right, we have the Tarte Creamy Bronzer. And we're going to use this concealer to put it on. <laughs> this old concealer, I should say. Brush. Okay, blended that in, thought I was filming, and I wasn't. You know what, I don't know where all my other ones are, but I, so I'm going to use the Peach Bloom Lip and Chic Tint again in the Peach Glow shade. i got to find the other two that I have. All right, let's blend that in. I'm not smelling it today. 
Oh, maybe I am a little bit. Okay, the Tarte Shape Tape Setting Powder. Now we're going to go with the Do You Setting Powder from Too Faced for my T-Zone. <sighs> Do's kind of small. Is this, um, I'm wondering, I think that might be like, is it watermelon? I've never smelled this one before. Like, every time I've used it, I couldn't smell anything. I think it's like a watermelon. Because the foundation is like a watermelon infused to smell. The do you. Okay, the Too Faced Graham Teddy Bear Bear Doll Bronzer. It's supposed to smell like graham crackers, but I don't smell it. I didn't smell it before I lost my smell, so. It's a liar. This is really light. Which, I don't mind. Because I'd rather build up than try to blend out like I normally have to. So, where's my brush? There it is. To contour my nose. Some people kind of go up like this when they contour. So I've been trying that a couple times. I don't really, I don't know if it really makes a difference, but like, you know. Okay, let's blend, blend, blend. Okay, we're gonna use the Too Faced Christmas in Rome palette. Uh, and we're going to use No Place Like, let's, um, actually let's cut her cuter on a scooter. Let's use this. Cuter on a scooter. That's so cute. Ooh, that's pigmented.
every time I forget the, about the brushes until I get to this one. Okay, we're going to use the Too Faced Diamond Light Highlighter. And look how it like has that shift. I love it. So it like doesn't look like it picks up on the brush then it's like oh it is highlighting okay let's go in with honey pot and put it on the bottom especially because you know, I did a black on um in my underneath. So let's do more of I should have done the push up. Oh well. Well let's do mixture. Let's do both. Let's see what color that turns into. This is push up. I'm going to use the Tarte Lip Architect in the shade Cutie Pie. Okay, and then I'm going to go on the Too Faced Melt the Matte Gingerbread Spice 1. Gingerbread Girl is what it's called. Oops, I kind of went out of the lines. I actually tasted something. Hmm. It actually tastes pretty good too. Okay, we're gonna use this Too Faced Peach Mist Mattifying Setting Spray. Shake me, baby. So it says on it. So maybe that's why I had the spots that one time. Maybe I didn't shake it. You know what? Before I put the gloss on though, I'm going to use this highlight. I've, I've, I've seen some people put like a highlight on the actual lip. And I don't know if this is too dark of a color. If it's going to actually look good. Mm, I don't know. Never mind. Alright, let's go in with the Hangover Pillow Balm for the gloss. I'm still kind of tasting that. I'm going to like eat my lips today. Keep looking at them like, mmm. But now that I have a gloss, it probably won't be the same. Alright, let's go in with Heaven for Above the Eye. And then let's go in with Silk Teddy for in the corners. This is Silk Teddy. It looks like a pretty, like, light pink color. 
but I don't know what it's actually showing up as. Hmm. Anyway, I guess we're going to go in with this mascara again, the Better Than Sex Too Faced Mascara. Just because it's right here. Actually, I'm still tasting something, so. Mm. All right, this is the final look using two tart Tuesday stuff. Let me know what you thought you think. <laughs> And comment down below. And the riddle of the day is why did the vampire take an art class? Comment down below. See you next time.